Hey, greetings everyone. Lieutenant Colonel Allen West, the chairman of the Republican Party of Texas. I'm also a very strong supporter of our Second Amendment because the founding fathers knew that an armed individual is a citizen, an unarmed individual is a subject. And right now we have a bill that's so critical in the state of Texas, HB 1927. Texas is on the verge of becoming the 21st state to have constitutional carry, which means that if you pass a background check, BATF Form 4473, you don't need to go to the government to get a permit to carry your firearm. That's so important. That's a right that we have. And right now, HB 1927 was sent back from the Senate with several amendments that could have killed it on a technicality. And last night, for whatever reason, House Democrats did not allow it to be killed on that technicality. So HB 1927 will now go into what is called a conference committee between the House and the Senate so that they can resolve any type of differences. We need to get HB 1927 constitutional carry passed and onto Governor Abbott's desk. And so what I would ask you to do is to make sure that you call Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick and the members of the Texas State Senate to ensure that we get a clear vote on HB 1927. I would have preferred that it did not have any poison pill amendments attached to it, but thanks to House Democrats, seven of whom crossed cross party lines to vote for HB 1927 out of the House in the first place. So this is a bipartisan issue. We all should stand for our Second Amendment rights, for our liberty and freedom, especially when we see what is happening on our streets with the defund the police movement, Antifa, Black Lives Matter, all of these seditious, subversive groups that are out on our streets. So please call Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick and your Texas State Senators to make sure they support HB 1927 constitutional carry and get it passed and the Governor Abbott's desk for signature. God bless you all. God bless Texas. Thank you.